Welcome to Step Into the Valley with Katrina Dew at the Three Step Realty Group. In today's episode, we're gonna be talking about ways to stretch your dollar. I know with what's going on today, people, ourselves included, are looking for ways to make our money last longer and stretch. So I've got 20 ideas for you. We're gonna go over a few right now. Now the first one is pretty simple or easy for your internet, your cable, your telephone, cell phone usage. See if you can bundle that package with one provider if possible, because they will typically give you better deals to do that. Or your current provider don't want, does not want to lose you, so call them. They may be able to give you different kinds of discounts and deals. Better yet, cut the cable all together and stream a service with your favorite shows. We actually have, personally, we have Netflix, we have Amazon Prime and Disney Plus for our three little kids. Who am I kidding? I love those movies too. <laughs> so another thing you could do is adjust your thermostat just a few degrees down or a few degrees up for heating and cooling to save on some of the energy usage from your heating and air conditioning system. Speaking of saving on energy costs or electricity costs, turn off idle appliances that aren't you're not using at that time. Turn your computers down, sh shut your computers down, power them off when you're not using them. Change your light bulbs to LED bulbs if possible. Because in fact, I did an episode a while ago talking about the savings of incandescent bulbs versus LED bulbs. And using LED bulbs throughout your home could save a home $6,000 in energy usage costs a year. <laughs> Another thing you could do to save on potential big money costs is get a home warranty because those will protect you from having to spend on costly repairs needed if they happen. For example, a water heater, air conditioning, heaters. It could save you a lot of money on those in the future. Another thing you could do is refinance your home. If you're a homeowner, interest rates are still at historical lows. It's still a good time to refinance. Call your lender today to see if you have the option to do that. If you don't have a lender, call us and we'll get you connected to someone great. <laughs> you know, another way that can help you keep track of your money so you can stretch it longer is actually track your household income and expenses so you know where money's coming in and out because you may be surprised at what you find. I know when we did it for the very first time years ago, we were surprised at how much money we were spending on eating out and activities like that. We didn't give it up, but we were smarter with it. <laughs> now, there are many more ideas we have for you. So click on the link below to get all of 20 of those ideas that we have for stretching your dollars and we actually have a money tracking form for you as well if you click on that link and if you have any questions or you know anybody that has any questions about what's going on in the real estate market today give us a call at the number below we're happy to be there for you and in the meantime subscribe to our youtube channel because we have a new video coming out for you every friday see you then